Hi friends, are you interested to work on IntelliJ IDA? But you are not interested to pay anything? Then this video for you. You can install IntelliJ IDA without any cost and without activating any license code. Let's start the installation process. Just open jetprimes.com idea download portal. I have given this link in description. If you need, you can use that. And in this page, you can see the IntelliJ IDA Ultimate. That is so the latest version of IntelliJ IDA. You, if you need, you can use it, but you have to fade for that. Okay, if you need free version means just scroll down. You can see the IntelliJ IDA Community Edition. You can download the application file. Click on download button. It will download. Actually, I already downloaded it. So I can see that application in my downloads. I'm going to click on it. It will start the installation. Then it will show the one pop up window where you can choose the destination folder where you have to install your IntelliJ IDA software. In click browse button, you can choose the folder for your destination. And then another window will open. Here you have to click, uh, if you need a shortcut means you have to click this button and uh, if you need a context menu, you can Click on this and if you, if you are going to work on this project, choose whatever projects you need and then click next button. Another window will open, just uh, it will show jet primes and install options. Click on that. It will start the installation and it will take uh, nearly five minutes. Just wait for that. Then you will see this window it will show the finish button just click on it now you have a IntelliJ IDA in your system just go to the shortcuts on the software IntelliJ IDA and it will open the project like this I already installed it and I already created one project so it's showing here if you want to create one new project, just click on this uh, button and click new, click project. On pop-up will window display. Here I'm going to give my project name sample four and the location that project need to be stored, you can give that. And if you want to create JIT repository for this option, you can click this one. And whatever language you are going to work on it, you can choose that. And build systems, JDK version. If you are already having a JDK, you can choose that. Otherwise, just click on add SDK. It will show the download option. If you need, you can download the JDK. Then create. button just click on new window my project gets created you can see the folders like uh, those inside that you can see main java file and also another folder idea inside that you can see few xml files and git ignore files and also external libraries are there. Just click on this. Uh, if you need to add other lines of code, you can add it here. I'm giving my channel name.
save my code. Then I'm going to run this project. For that, there is one button run. You can click on it. The build gets started. You can see the options build. It's running. It will take few minutes time. Here you can see the result. It's just printed, which is I have given. That's it, friends. You can create a new project and install the IntelliJ IDA in your system without any cost. I hope this video is useful to you. And if you are a new user, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.